is the mission of my life. That's the purpose of my life and I have made it my single point agenda to spend all my years only in the midst of the youth of India. On that note, I'd like to begin. Good morning to everybody. And I extend a, my sincere thanks to the GSFC University for not only giving me, inviting me here for this foundation course, giving me an opportunity to talk to all of you, address all of you. This is something very close to my heart. Uh, but also making me a part of the team of the university uh, as a member of the board of the university. So the last time I was here, I was in the convocation, which was the ceremony where you are sending students out of the system. And today I'm here to welcome all of you into the system. So a very big warm welcome to all of you students, young students who have come from different schools across Baroda, maybe other places as well. Uh, but before that, I'd also like to specially acknowledge uh, the support that I have received from Mr. Tanmay Nair and Ms. Sudha and Ms. Neha Madhim, Neha Madhim, all these people who are working so hard for making this foundation course a big success for you. Before I even start, let me tell you one thing. The last thing that should happen is starting a session on discipline 5 to 10 minutes late. Ye nahi hona so that has happened today. So my very sincere apologies to all of you for that. Sometimes, sometimes things are not in your hands. I was submitting some question paper where it got delayed and all that. But still, when we talk about discipline and we start late, that is like a non-starter. That is like a speed breaker. So what should we do? Kya punishment diya jai? Something should be done, na? Okay, now let us, let us start with... First, let us sit quietly for two minutes. So before I start the session, I am not a trainer uh, by profession, but I have handled a lot of training sessions and I have done... I have been a consultant to a very major training project of the government. Plus, I have done my PhD, my research in the area of international economics where I have spent a good amount of my time trying to understand the importance of skill development for employability and for the economy. And my, you know, my, profession, my subject is uh, specialization is economics and international economics. So I want that whatever possible in terms of skill development, if we can make a change in the, the present population or the youth of India, then when we use the word demographic dividend, demographic dividend and India is at a very important juncture where by 2025, 24, 25, any time we will be overtaking the population of China and we will be the fastest growing country in the world. Now data has also given us many other things which for which you have all come to the center stage. We are all, you are going to see a different part of the world a different part of the, you are millennials. You are millennials and you are going to run this world after some time. So, my salute to all of you who have come here, chosen to come into a very good university, GSFC University, with some big vision and plan for your lives. Before we begin, I'll start with a small piece of meditation or one, two minutes of, you call it meditation or you call it just sitting calmly and breathing. मुझे आपको कुछ सवाल करना है, मुझे आपसे कुछ पूछना है। You know, one of the toughest topics to discuss is discipline, and that too from somebody who is not so disciplined. So I'm not a right person for this, but then I have. That's why I I'm probably qualified to talk because I am moving from indiscipline to discipline, and a lot of things are changing in my life because of that. I would like to share that with you, and I would like to help you also to get there. Are you all ready? Yes. Want to take the journey? Yes. This yes means five people are ready. How many are ready? This is not a this is not a sin, uh, unilateral session. No? It's not a one-sided monologue. There are two ways I can do it. I is a boring lecture ki tarah kara sakti. Ya to interactive banakar ke aapke life mein changes la sakti hu. Aapko kya chahiye? 
सेशन लेक्चर सेशन और इंटरक्टिव सेशन हाउ मेनी गो फॉर इंटरक्शन प्लीज पुट अप योर हैंड्स देर आर सम हू वॉन्ट लेक्चर बट मैच आई थिंक पीछे वालों को सुनाई नहीं दे रहा द वन इन द बैक डू यू वॉन्ट लेक्चर मोड और इंटरक्शन मोड इंटरक्शन इंटरक्टिव सेशन टू वे देन आई विल नीड अ माइक ऑल्सो फॉर मूविंग टू बी फेयर इट्स नॉट फेयर ना आई हैव अ माइक एंड यू डोंट हैव अ माइक सो वी नीड सम वॉलंटियर्स ऑल्सो टू पास द माइक आई डोंट थिंक टीचर्स शुड बी रनिंग विद माइक एनी वॉलंटियर्स एनीबडी रेडी टू बी वॉलंटियर एंड मूविंग विद माइक्स कमान टीचर्स करेंगे ये काम नहीं ना इज इट गुड फॉर टीचर्स टू कम विद माइक कमान 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 Who is going to do it? Who will pass on the mics? They are students. Then only they qualify. Okay, good, very good, good young man. Uh, please close your eyes for about one minute and breathe deeply. I may do an own part for you so that you fall into the tuning. Then I will ask you one question. So that you are in the mood to answer me. Please close your eyes, everybody. Think of the most pleasant thing that you like, something that you like. आपको जो बहुत पसंद है, जो painting पसंद है, या घर में जो चित्र पसंद है, जो scenery पसंद है. It can be anything that makes you feel calm. Anything that makes you feel very, very proud of yourself, very happy with yourself. Just half a minute. Deep breathe. Breathe deeply. Go deep. And repeat with me. Oh. I heard one boy say om Please close your eyes and repeat with me If we are going to do a session on discipline it starts now If you want to be part of this journey of improvement then you have to start with following the instructions that are being given When I say 1 2 3 Everybody will start saying om om is the original sound of the world nad kehte hain use wo nad jo hamare nadi se nikalti hai and that makes your mind very very calm some youngsters have not done this so unhe hansi bhi aati hogi but it's fine concentrate on your breath concentrate on your breathing aapke swas pe dhyan rakhe ek bar sirf om boliye fir hum question puchte hain 1 2 3 start o thank you everybody you can open your eyes this exercise is nothing to do with religion this is nothing to do with uh, spiritualism at the moment this exercise was only to bring your mind to the present moment you are thinking of so many things that have happened yesterday or in the last few days what is going to happen hum is purani baatein mein jaate hain aage ki baatein mein jaate hain par ab mein nahi jeete so we need you to come back to this auditorium and be here and invest your next one and a half hours of time for this session which will be partially done by me partially done by you and we will be in a it is not a teaching session it is a 
it's not a training session it is a teaching learning interactive session so we are all going to learn from each other yahan pe koi aisa nahi hai jisse hum kuch seekh nahi sakte okay so let's come on to discuss over at the moment this word discipline as a critical life skill before i start into the content i want to ask you one question you have just said omkar and your mind is calm now be honest close your eyes and tell think about aap aankhein nahi bhi band karo to chalega but just think about this word discipline and tell me what feeling does it associate with or what is the feeling you get when you hear the word discipline given the one who introduced me is sudha madam she did mention something about discipline in school so from your kg class till now or from your house you have been hearing this word discipline tabhi gujarati ma samlo hindi ma samlo tumhe the vishesh ke koi shish ke ya kuch aur bolte hai koi par aapko ek niyam ka palan karna hai ye suna hoga apan baat kar so ye kaisa feeling deta hai aapko do tarah ke feelings hote hain और एक तीसरा भी होता है जिसमें कोई फीलिंग नहीं रहता बट पहला है पॉजिटिव फीलिंग और दूसरा है नेगेटिव फीलिंग फीलिंग कभी झूठ नहीं बोलते फीलिंग्स आर ऑलवेज वेरी ट्रूथफुल आप किसी भी इंसान के साथ रहिए यू मे फर्गेट वॉट दे स्पोक टू यू बट यू विल नेवर फर्गेट हाउ दे मेड यू फील सो नाउ आई वॉन्ट टू गिव वॉन्ट टू आस्क यू टू गिव मी ऑनेस्ट आंसर I want an honest answer from you. Honest, सच्चे दिल से बोलिए How many of you got a positive feeling? Okay. Thank you. How many of you felt bit of negative feeling? Negative feeling when you hear the word discipline. is this classroom not honest or is this group not honest or is this the truth i am saying that if you look at discipline from a positive way then you don't even need this exercise that's wonderful but tell me honestly tell me honestly how many of you felt discipline kuch negative feeling aaya sachi batai till we get to the fact i i will not proceed how many of you felt some emotions which were not pleasant at least there are some people who are honest ha huh, good 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 very good good including teacher yeah nice usually the word discipline so i don't know why this happens but we'll discuss it a little more fine majority of you have of you have said positive but we are also looking at it now go back to your childhood go back to your childhood <coughs> and from there we have to come till now it's a journey so let's find out what is your oldest memory of discipline see bachpan ke kuch logo ko bahut kuch yaad rehta hai kuch logo ko kuch bahut kam yaad rehta hai i don't know how it is so some people have a very good memory they remember everything that happened in childhood now you think about this journey in your life and try to see where did you start disciplining What was the oldest memory you had or experience you have had of discipline? Anyone? And now we start the interaction. Teacher, faculty, are you faculty? Okay. So oldest memory. Where have you started disciplining in your life? <coughs> Those who have got your bags, no, please keep them. Bags for a big boy, उठा के नहीं जाएगा. I can assure you. कोई ले रखी जाऊंगा लेट एवरीबडी बी फ्री बी फिजिकली फ्री कंफर्टेबल एंड लिसन शांति से काम टूर आई कम फ्रॉम एम एस यूनिवर्सिटी महाराजा साइज जीरो यूनिवर्सिटी वी हैव स्टूडेंट्स वेर एटी परसेंट स्टूडेंट्स कम फ्रॉम गुजराती मीडियम सो समटाइम्स आई हैव टू यूज गुजराती ऑल्सो आई डोंट नो हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू कम फ्रॉम गुजराती मीडियम आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू आस्क दैट क्वेश्चन बट Will you find it comfortable if I speak only in English or English Hindi? How many prefer English Hindi? English Hindi mix? Okay, fine. 
I'm not saying Indi English Gujarati because there may be some students from outside Baroda or Gujarat. How many are from outside Gujarat? Gujarat ke bahar kitne log are? Where are you all from? Where are you from? Rajasthan se. Maharashtra. Maharashtra. Other states. How many students from outside Gujarat? How many Shuksha hai? Where are you from? Hello ma'am, my name is Subhiksha. So, I have been learning Carnatic music for quite some time, for about 10 years or something. And I started when I was in second standard or so. And my mother used to tell me to practice my music. And for that, I had to wake up at 5.30 or 5 o'clock in the morning because she told me that your voice is better at that time. So, when you practice at that time, it will become better. So, at that time, I had to wake up at 5.30. You didn't like You didn't like it? <laughs> no, you didn't I, was like really, it? Yeah. I was really, really young. So, I didn't like it, but I had to. Okay. But that definitely... So how old you were? Um, I was in second standard to say 7, 8 years. 7, 8 years. So, she was 7, 8 years old. Her mother used to tell her to wake up at 5.30 to discipline, I mean, to have the discipline of practicing. Carnatic <laughs> yes. music. Yes. So, voice, according to the mother, voice is very good in the morning. You are very lucky there are some people who make the children stand in the water and sing, in cold water. So you are lucky. But still, it is bad enough. At 7 years old, 5.30 in the morning, is it very pleasant? Is it very nice? Anyway, any other examples? Anybody else wants to share? You are free to share. Some, some memory, old memory of discipline. It can be negative as well as positive. It is not necessary, it should be negative. Positive for yourself. But what is the oldest memory? Now here, if anyone wants to share, you can call him. What's his name? What's your name? Archit. 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 Okay, uh, let's have one uh, rule, thumb rule. Whoever wants uh, the mic can do this. Not like this. Because both are a Do this. I want the mic. So you two, three times you do it. All of you do it once. So please arrange for 400 mics, madam. Madam, arrange for 400 mics. <laughs> They're all saying. Once, once, once. Once you do. Okay, only 100 want. We don't need 400. Okay, so now anybody wants to share their old experience, childhood experience? of discipline. What is the oldest experience? Jitra ho sakya, where does it start? Where does the word discipline start in your life? Yeah. Let's go back. I think we should find out now about ourselves. Hame khud ke baare mein nahi As Go back. Remember, go back to your childhood. Yes, Vita. Um, like, my parents are both working. So Introduction. Huh. Uh, my name is Virat Sitodia, uh, BSc Biotechnology first year. So my parents both are working. So nursery summer tuition jata hoon. So ऐसे school से जा uh, school से घर पे आना है, सोना है, फिर tuition जाना है, tuition में homework करना है and then घर पे आना है. तो हाँ वो बचपन से ऐसे. Not like that. <laughs> Didn't like that. You used to ask yourself, why am I doing this all the time? हाँ like. क्या ज़िंदगी है? ये जीना भी कोई जीना. And how old were you that time? Three or four. Three or four. Okay. Three or four? I was like, I'm going to go to the house. Three or four, you are alone. <laughs> One big round of applause to this young man. He's a brave one. If anybody requires help, you can ask him for help. <laughs> Anyone else? Now, three or four is already very young. But anything you remember before that? Anything before that? Two, two, two and a half, two. Anyone? Anything? Okay. Let me ask you a general question. I'll ask a general question and I look forward to getting an intelligent answer from you. What is the first thing we all learn 
in terms of discipline. Then you have memory. Not before jaha memory nahi hai bori. So, what is the first thing we all learn as a baby, as a small child? Don't remember? <laughs> Don't say toilet habits, okay? <laughs> that, is that is true, that is correct actually. But then you don't remember it. Because they start, that starts very early. That starts when you are 3-4 months old. Yes please. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning. Myself, Samit. Uh, I am from CAC, BTEC, uh, first year. Uh, first thing that came in my mind that uh, we should go by the rules, uh, which uh, we, which were uh, which our parents told to go. Because uh, if we can't uh, if we can't go by the rules, uh, people will think what uh, what kind of child is and other that things. People will think. Huh? People will think. Okay. Very good. Interesting. No, but what is it? You're giving me some examples. Uh, not a good example, but uh, no, जब मतलब मैं जब छोटा था, तो जब hoteling वगैरह जाते थे, तो कभी-कभी मेरे को होता था कि मैं चढ़ जाता था ऐसे stage. कहाँ पे? मतलब hoteling वगैरह, hotels में वगैरह जाते थे हम लोग. बिल्कुल सही है. बिल्कुल सही है. हाँ, तो मैं ऐसे खड़ा हो जाता था, छोटा था तब. तो बोलते थे कि मत खड़ा हो conscious about what other people will think about our children. When guests come, hey, guest head, guest head, hey, guest head, guest head, you have to have discipline anytime. But the oldest, let me tell you what I think memory will take you back to the oldest form of uh, discipline that is of eating. When you eat your food, disciplining is the first thing that starts with parents. As a small baby, people, when you, when you are put something which is not you don't like, it's put into your mouth. You look as a child. But definitely child will do that. So the somebody will slap or somebody will shout. And that is a very unpleasant experience. But they try to force you to eat. First of all, many times you are made to eat at a time when you are not hungry. And sometimes you are made to eat more than you require. If you want to go to play, no, you finish and go. You never finish, so there's always an argument there. So disciplining the first form, even before going to school, it starts with food. And I think, of course, toilet habits is really the first thing. When you start with toilet habits as a child, the body starts learning to accustom to social norms. Society has, as he very rightly said, society teaches you how you should be disciplined. So you start from there, and this kind of thing, keeps on going on. Now, where does discipline start in your day today? In today's world, today, every day, how does the discipline start? Anyone? Now you are what, 18, 17, 18, 19, something like that? I asked you about 2 years, 3 years, 4 years. And now I am straight away fast tracking and bringing you to present day. Anyone can you tell me, is there anybody who has done NCC? Okay, good. Anybody who comes from armed forces background, jinke parents armed forces pe hain? Okay. Right, very good. So at least some of you should answer this question. That when you wake up, of course waking up in time is the first thing. Yeah. You want to say something? That's what I wanted to say. That yes, please. Up is the first thing. First thing is, alarm se pehle ya alarm ke baad? Alarm ke baad ho to kitne baad? 5 minute late ya 1 ghande ke baad? So that is the, that's where your discipline starts. Right, very good. But next what? After that, what is the next thing? 
An American uh, Armed Forces personnel once said that the first thing this is that you should be doing when you wake up is fold your blanket. How many of you do that? Very good. Not everybody does it, but have. So today we are starting our new challenge. Okay, thank you very much. So on this note, we start with a small journey from your childhood till now. But then this uh, university has made you do this foundation course, and they want to tell you something more than that. They want to tell you that make discipline a part of life skill. मतलब उसे एक जीने का अंदाज बनाओ जीने का तरीका बनाओ उसे अपनी जिंदगी के अंदर घोल लो और आपके रोजमर्रे की जिंदगी में ये डिसिप्लिन लाओ ये कहना चाहते हैं सो क्या ये थोपा जा रहा है आपके ऊपर या क्या ये करने जैसा है लेट अस एट द एंड ऑफ टूडे सेशन वी विल नो वेदर यू वॉन्ट टू डू इट वेदर यू आर गोइंग टू डू इट और वेदर दिस इज गोइंग टू बी जस्ट अ टॉपिक एज पार्ट ऑफ योर फाउंडेशन बस हमने सीखा उसके बारे में दैट्स इट फिनिश और आर यू गोइंग टू मेक एनी चेंजेस इन योर लाइफ इट डिपेंड्स ऑन यू एंड इट डिपेंड्स ऑन हाउ मच यू वांट टू बी इन दिस जर्नी विथ मी सो मूविंग फर्दर फ्रॉम योर लेट्स गो इन टू सम फंडामेंटल बोरिंग पार्ट ऑफ डिसिप्लिन द डेफिनेशन ऑफ डिसिप्लिन डेफिनेशन ये टिपिकली थियोरी में होता है हर सब्जेक्ट का एक थियोरी होता है एक प्रैक्टिस होती है तो थियोरी का पार्ट है ये पर समझ लो समझ तो लेते हैं Let us see what it is saying. What does the classical definition say? The word discipline comes from the Latin word called disciplina, and it means instruction and training. It does not mean marna, pitna, kuch nothing like that. There is no word where there is punishment. Please see that. The word discipline comes from instruction and training. So, what is the instruction and training? Right now, why I am doing something like that? I am telling you to close your eyes. You are closing your eyes. I am saying do home. You are saying you are doing home. मैं ऐसा कहे तो हाथ हिलाओ ना आपके हिला रहे हो. कोई compulsory नहीं है but you are doing it ना. Something about the way I told you made you feel कि कुछ है बात इसमें. Let us try. Yes. So that is the beginning of discipline. We ask the fact that you are sitting here and listening to me, not throwing arrows on me, not throwing eggs on me, not throwing. Uh, books or papers on me. You can't do all that with all these teachers around. But if you're not doing it, then disciplining is happening. वो हो रहा है अपने आप. So this is one. The practice of training your mind. This is what the Oxford Dictionary and Cambridge also talk about. They say the practice of training your mind and your body so that you can control your actions and obey rules. That's what you did. we are sitting quietly but i see some people sitting very restlessly even though i did om omkar ke bavajood kuch log apna pair hila rahe hain kuch apna haath hila rahe hain kuch aise apne mobile ko dekh rahe hain ye sab chalega that means they are not in the journey still they are not joined the journey but if you join the journey you will get something from it You are likely to get something from here, which you can take with you all your life. You can't see it. You can't see that. It is not like that bouquet which was given to me. आपको मतलब जाते जाते मैं आपको चलो ये भेंट ले लूँ ऐसा नहीं दूँगी. But something will happen which you will find it changing your life. So training your mind and body. You know this mind and body relationship is very very interesting. I don't know how many of you know about mind body relationship. Do you have any background about this? It's a it's a subject of psychology but it is very much required and a very much part of our life mind body relationship remind me to talk about it when i give you examples of discipline particularly when i talk about armed forces mind body relationship anybody knows about mind body relationship yes like let's say if i come running close to you and put a finger near your eyes immediately you will move instinctive reaction by the the mind has perceived that there is danger agar aap raste pe gaadi chala rahe ho to automatically guess it on you because aapka man itne tezi se usko malum pad jata hai ki yahan pe danger hai yahan se jao suppose you see traffic jam you avoid the road and you go to some other road aapke masi foi jo aise se aapka jhada ho kitna mote ho kitna mota ho gaya hai are marks itne hi kam marks aaye ye sab logon se aap automatically dur bhagte ho 
Yes or no? एक किलोमीटर से पता चलता था दिस इज डेंजर यस और नो शादी में जाते हैं तो यू ट्राई टू अवॉइड दिस थिंग आप अब पूछोगे कौन कौन आने वाला शादी में दैट आई नॉट कम सो दिस इज परसेप्शन ऑफ द माइंड एंड देन द बॉडी मूव्स सो फास्ट यू नो इन रियलिटी द माइंड एंड बॉडी वर्क्स सो क्लोजली इफ आई एक्सप्लेन टू यू यू विल बी सो सरप्राइज ऑन द स्केल ऑफ 0 टू 10 स्केल ऑफ 0 टू 10 Suppose this is zero and this is ten. Okay, this is the mind, or let's say this is the body taking tension, body taking some pain. Suppose you have got hurt, आप गिर गए हो, आपको कहीं चोट लग गई है या किसी और ने कुछ धक्का दे दिया, कुछ भी हो गया. शरीर से कुछ शरीर में कोई problem है. You are having a problem in your body. The body feels the pain. Mind does not feel the pain. body feels the pain 1 2 3 4 5 6 after 6 body cannot take the pain it pushes the pain to the mind and then the mind will start acting mujhe bahut tension mujhe bahut pain ho raha hai now till that time you do not speak the moment mind the body stops functioning the or the body stops uh, they, it cannot take the tolerance level then it pushes the pain to the mind then the mind starts says How do they expect me to write the exam now? How can I do this? आपको पता नहीं है कि मुझे problem है. You don't know I'm having so much, of, I'm suffering. Then you start shouting at people. You show anger. Then when your behavior becomes very bad, somebody will give you one slap on your face. बहुत है क्यों? बहुत ज़्यादा हो गया. बंद करो. Then again the body will take. So body and mind they work in a very way. When there is lot of stress, for example, you have exams, you are not prepared. How many have faced this situation? अरे सो मेनी एग्जाम नॉट प्रिपेयर नाउ माइंड इज टेकिंग फुल लोड लोड इज गोइंग फ्रॉम वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सडनली स्टमक पेज फ्रॉम माइंड इट विल शिफ्ट टू बॉडी ये ना मैंने कहीं था कुछ हो रहा है मेरे पेट आई कॉन्ट राइट दूसरे आज ही आई एम टेकिंग अ डे ऑफ देन यू नो नो वाई इट देन यू गेट हेड Then the whole family are you? क्या हो गया बेटा क्या हो गया बेटी? Whole family is around you. So you have to focus on what? You are not going for it. Problem solved. So mind and your body they play very nice games with each other and they are working very close. They work very close. Now practice of training your mind and body so that you control your actions. No, if I have not studied well, it's okay. I will get less marks. I will face a situation. I am ready to face a situation and obey the rules. The rule is my parents have paid fees. I should go and face it. I will not take. I will not take a drop. One year drop from board exam is going to cost money to your parents. It will cost them suffering and it will make them feel that our son is wasting time, daughter is wasting time. So you are all those successful people who have had the discipline. Of clearing your exams and coming here, so one round of applause for you. After the exam, you clear your exams. I think they are all from 12. They have all cleared 12, right? And what is the percentage range for the highest percentage and all that for which courses? Engineering. Engineering. How many engineering students? Oh, majority are engineering. So good of them. And how many of the other courses? Can you just uh, tell me your courses and so that I know the profile of students? Science. How many science students? Okay, very good. Any uh, humanities courses? You know, management studies. Management studies. How many? Right. Then we have some other courses, no? Like safety and all those other things. Fire and safety. It comes as a part of this. So we are predominantly science students and uh, management students who have commerce background. You are all from commerce. Okay, very good. कुछ सपने हैं ना दिल में? दिमाग में कुछ सपने हैं? कितने के दिमाग में है दिलो दिमाग में सपने लेके आए थे या नहीं हाउ मेनी आई ड्रीम्स हाउ मेनी आई एम्स गोल्स पुट यू हैंड्स अप सो ये लास्ट रो को आपने मना किया है जवाब देने से डोंट डू दैट ना सर मैं अलाउ नॉट टू स्पीक ना सो मच ऑफ डिसिप्लिन इन दैट दे आर नॉट सपोज टू ओपन देयर माउथ लास्ट थ्री फोर रोज इन्होंने बोला आपको जवाब नहीं देना मैं इनकी क्लास ले रही आप बोलो बेटा फ्री ही बोलो यू हैव ड्रीम्स 
इतने डरे हुए हैं बेचारे बीबीए स्टूडेंट्स प्लीज आंसर मेरा प्रॉब्लम हो जाएगा उन्होंने कपड़े त्याग दिए थे और सिर्फ ये धोती पहनना रखा था एंड ही मेंटेन दैट डिसिप्लिन टिल द एंड ही मेंटेन सो मेनी अदर ही बी सेड अन्न त्याग ही वुड डू अन्न त्याग इट वाज नॉट लाइक यहां अन्न त्याग और पीछे जाके समोसा खा लिया दैट्स नॉट ओके तो महात्मा गांधी ही यूज्ड टू क्लीन हिज ओन वॉशरूम एवरीबॉडी यू ही यूज्ड टू स्वीप ही यूज्ड टू महात्मा गांधी ऑलवेज मेंशन दैट सेल्फ डिसिप्लिन इन अ मैन आई हैव एडेड और वुमन मुझे बुरा लग गया इसलिए मैंने वुमन डाल दिया is the key to a peaceful and successful life if a person knows how to control his mind and body at times of anger he is disciplined anger gusse ko kabu gusse par kabu pana to control your mind and anger it is impossible that we are not angry about things choti badi kai sari cheezon ke sath hame narazgi hoti hai we feel anger because you know what is what is the what is anger what is the cause of anger what is the root cause of anger anyone anyone knows what is the cause of anger why do we get angry yeah problem uh, boys are you signing something some documents okay yeah sorry your name please uh my name is sandeep pandya i'm from voice sandeep uh, uh computer science engineering tech uh according to me anger is caused because of problems Thanks. if somebody is facing problems uh, he is uh, going to anger okay <coughs> but uh, he he or she will perceive it as a problem no? whether there is a problem or not we don't know yes. like mom has made some food he or she does not like that food Huh. That's a problem for him or her. Yes. But mother doesn't find any problem. She says, "Thou should eat. 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 Eat.
One step more. Good morning, ma'am. My name is Urja Shyam Singh. I'm from BSC Biotechnology. Uh, I I think so because of any kind of stress you're facing in your day to day life, that will that is also a root cause of anger, I guess. Because I've also been through that. So that's my personal experience. That's all. What causes stress? Yeah, I mean, of course, stress, stress causes anger that everybody is uh, agreeing on. But what causes that stress? As she said, she said that if things do not happen the way you want, then you get anger. You feel anger. Very good. Very good answers. You have come very close. I will add one more point to it and take it one step further just to enlighten you. Can you give me some examples of when do you get angry? What are the situations where you get angry? Like not getting a ticket for a movie that you want to see? Not getting the mobile that you choose to buy? Parents not accepting this mobile because it's too costly? I'm looking at iPhone 14, Apple 14, and parents think I'm okay with like 20,000 phone is fine for you. But these are all causes of anger, yes? Losing a match, losing a cricket match while playing with friends. Yeah? Liking to eat food, but when you eat more food, you become fat and everybody makes fun of you. You don't like that. Okay? Anything else? Exam time. Who do you hate most during exam? Teachers, no? You're a teacher, right? You hate. And if you get if you get bad results in the exam, worse than expected, invariably fault is that of teacher. Teacher has not taught properly. Period. Yes or no? Yes. 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 No. Yes. Be honest. We usually say that. We usually give these excuses. Okay. Now, stress is not the cause for anger. Things not happening the way you want is not the is the cause for anger. But the anger is because you cannot accept the things. The way it is. Your inability to accept a different reason or a different thing. You don't know to accept change. You cannot accept that. You don't want it. Am I right? Yes. Your inability to accept that situation is what causes the anger. The situation does not cause. You don't like that sabzi. You don't like banger. Therefore, there is problem. Bengal se problem hai. Yes or no? So, hamari acceptance hai. That's what he says. If you are able to control your mind and body enough to have control over your anger, then things will be sorted. Another person, Abraham Lincoln, gave a very important statement. The discipline is, what is discipline? Discipline is choosing between what you want now and what you want, uh, sorry, what you want now and what you want most. There is a lot of difference. There is a very good example I would like to share with you. There was an experiment conducted in a school. Okay? In a small class, in maybe a class like 5th standard, the teacher brought lots of chocolates in a big bowl. She put it on the table and she said that you, these chocolates are for you only. You can take it. But there are three things. There are two. There are rules of this game. If you come immediately and take the chocolate, you can take two sweets. You can take the top managing director, chairman or CEO of their respective companies. So that is what the story teaches you. That if you decide the difference between what is now and what is the most, you have the best discipline in your life. So now this is just, uh, these are all only theoretical aspects. So don't think that we are lecturing only wala hai. It will not be like lecture. Tell me about this person. What have you read about him? What do you know about him? What do you know about him? Anyone? I am sure you have written essays and all in school. You have studied about him. What is special about him? What is the greatness about him? Anyone? Anyone waving the hand? I can see only someone waving legs. <laughs> He is known as the Missile Man of the India. Missile Man of India? Okay. He was known? Okay. Passed away? No. Then? That's all. Yes, please. 
ये ब्लू ब्लू टी शर्ट है अच्छा भाई तो भैया जो लोग अपने पैर को ऊपर तक रख के ऐसे ऐसे हिला रहे हैं ना उनका भी मैं काउंट करूंगी कि वो बाइक चाहते हैं देर आर सम पीपल सिटिंग एंड पुटिंग द लेग ऑफ दैट इज नॉट गुड गुड दैट इज नॉट बॉडी एटिकमेंट बट इफ देक देर लेग आई विल गो गिव द माइक टू देम ऑल्सो समझा समझ समझ में आया आप लोगों को तो माइक वहां जाए तो जिसका भी पैर ऊपर है थोड़ा देख लेस APJ Abdulkalam was dedicated to his work. Very dedicated to his work. Then mm, very disciplined. Very disciplined. But, uh, his work and the punctuality. 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 Very good. Thank you. What is his background? What is his childhood like? What kind of family he came from? A fisherman. Very ordinary fisherman family, and he was from a very poor background, humble background, I would say. But what was it that made him become so special? He had this dream in his life that he should do something very big, and he made the missile. He became the missile man of India, and he became the president of India, the most beloved president of India, and the, somebody who is being followed uh, so much by youngsters like you to learn more about life and to achieve something which you are dreaming. Thank you very much, Yash. So what did he say? That if you really want to shine like a sun, you have to learn to burn like the sun. 99% perspiration 1% inspiration is what they say chalo you can change the percentage according to your liking 80% perspiration 20% today the world has become very smart so they don't want people who are working hard they want people who are working smart if you have a shortcut to things no problem do the shortcut but get the results that's what america teaches the world because it's a capitalist country So taking this discussion further from here, making discipline a life skill. What is the what is the meaning of life skill? Anybody has heard this? Have you heard this in your school? Life skill. Do you know the difference between life skill and art of living? Art of living is Sri Sri Ravi Shankar Ji Maharaj. So they say that Sri Sri. What is life skill? How many of you are hearing this for the first time? Life skills only in this uh, foundation goes. Huh? I mean, they are doing a phenomenal job of offering this to you. Getting a foundation course like this gives you such a wide world view, and you become equipped with so many skills that now you can take your course very nicely. So, uh, what is the meaning of life skills? Have you heard of the word called? hard skills soft skills anyone have you heard of life skills at all what are life skills okay there was a girl who was not very educated okay there was a young girl who was not very educated and uske building mein sare log bahut padhe likhe the and this is a real story ye ye sachi mein hua tha mumbai mein it had happened in mumbai in chembur there was a girl who was not she dropped out of school but she was very helpful to me she was always very helpful she was always available for anybody who needed her support so in her neighboring house one day there was a elderly person a father, there was a gentleman and his granddaughter his son was a doctor uh, and his granddaughter who is a phd in microbiology they had both gone to their offices they had both gone to their respective college and to office and the grandfather suddenly felt lot of pain in the chest in the apartment there was nobody else who was able to take any decision and at that time this young girl immediately ran she called the ambulance this happened many years back when there was no phone also so she went she found out from a public phone call she found out who to call she called for ambulance she took that person she somehow managed to put all the money she had she took him to hospital admitted him they went to icu and by that time they sent the message and the other people came and the old person was saved now what kind of skill is this is it academic skill or is it a life skill life skill what is it what kind of skill is it what happened at that time what is that quality in her that made her do that मुझे क्या 
मेरे घर में तो नहीं हो रहा है किसी के घर में हो रहा है ऐसा सोचा उसने अगर कुछ मर जाएंगे तो बीच में तो मेरा नाम आ जाएगा ऐसे सोचा उसने ऐसे सोचा था उनके अपने बच्चे नहीं करे मैं क्यों भागू ऐसा नहीं सोचा क्या होगा अगर डॉक्टर में कुछ बोल देंगे तो कुछ नहीं सोचा उसने शी जस्ट थॉट दैट आई हैव टू हेल्प दैट पर्सन इट इज एम्पथी फॉर अनदर पर्सन इट इज अ क्वालिटी नोन एज एम्पथी इट इज अ क्वालिटी नोन एज काइंडनेस इट इज प्रेजेंस ऑफ माइंड एंड क्रिटिकल लाइफ स्किल एट अ क्रिटिकल टाइम टेकिंग द राइट डिसीशन एंड हेल्पिंग समी टेकिंग द राइट डिसीशन एंड मूविंग आउट ऑफ अ प्लेस इफ यू सी अ स्नेक यू डोंट स्टार्ट रेफरिंग टू अ बुक कि सांप वहां दिख रहा है मुझे क्या करना चाहिए आप भागोगे इट्स अ लाइफ स्किल सो यू यू हैव यू हैव ऑल ऑफ अस हैव वेरी गुड लाइफ स्किल्स हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू हैव दीज टाइम ऑफ क्वालिटीज नाउ व्हाट आर दीज व्हाट लेट्स सी व्हाट इज द डेफिनेशन देन यू विल कम टू नाउ दिस इज द क्लासिकल डेफिनेशन लेट्स गो टू द क्वालिटीज आई एम जस्ट रीडिंग अ लिटिल बिट फॉर यू टू नो अब दिस इज यू नो व्हेन द वर्ड लाइफ स्किल वाज यूज्ड फर्स्ट व्हेन यूनिसेफ वे वे बैक इन 2006 यूनिसेफ वांटेड टू हैव अ प्रोग्राम फॉर the ministry of azerbaijan for sports and uh, youth youth and sports so they came up with this and they gave the task to who and who worked on it and world health organization came up with this uh, definition that life skills are a group of so- psychosocial competencies and interpersonal skills that help people make informed decisions informed decision means have you taken the right decision have you chosen the right course have you done the homework before that Hey, do you know what course, what part of engineering you want to study? क्या आपको पता है कि engineering के बाद आपको क्या करना है? Do you know which specialization you want? Have you done this as an informed decision? If you have taken an informed decision, then you are doing good, very well. The next is solving problems. Are you a problem solver or are you a problem creator? What do you do? Do you create the problem or you are, are you the problem or are you a problem solver? How many of you are problem solvers at home? at home problem solver in which way can can we hear from you what kind of a problem solver can you give an example practical example anyone what from rajasthan you will need a mic huh? it won't be heard just you feel it will be heard but it won't be heard my sir from from pirani ages first year I am a problem solver. I am resolving arguments between my parents. Okay. So, how are you a problem solver? The argument is the problem, and uh, I have to resolve it. So, I am the solver. Oh, give him a big hand. In how many families? Wonderful, well done. In how many families the argument is because of the child? Oh God, we all agree. Argument between mummy and papa is because of you. One will say you are giving too much. इसको बहुत छूट दिया है. Yes or no? हाँ? इसको सब करने दिया. Mother will say keep quiet. I know. And that argument is done. This is very very common thing in families. Very common thing. And now. What are the other things? Let's quickly go fast. Let's quickly go ahead. Think critically. Think critically. Think critically. Critical means thinking, thinking with all the plus and minus, pros and cons, weighing everything properly. ये सही है या गलत है? मैंने मुझे J S F C University में जाना चाहिए या नहीं? या पारु University में जाए? या M S C University में? This question was there in your mind earlier. You have taken a critical decision to join GSFC University. So one round of applause for these teachers. They come and help us. Creativity, creatively, think creatively. Come up with a problem, solution with nobody else. किसी के पास एक सॉल्यूशन नहीं था ऐसा सॉल्यूशन आपके दिमाग में आया. Then you are a problem solver. Communicate effectively. Convey properly. You have to convey properly. Suppose your mother says. What time are you coming back this evening when you go to meet your friends? What is the correct answer you should give? Time, na? Maybe around this time. I don't know. Suppose you don't know the answer, you say I don't know. When I go there only, I'll know the program. We may be going for a movie. We may be going to a hotel, restaurant. It's okay if you say I don't know. But what is the question you should not ask her? 
What is the answer you should not give up? Anyone? Huh? What should not be your reaction? But usually it is a reaction. But what is not a good reaction? Come on. People at the bank should also answer, you encourage them to answer. This boy will lose one kilo weight. <laughs> Thank you, Bhattar. Yeah. Thank you, Bhattar. Bye. Every time you want to ask me. Every time I go out, you ask me this question. Yes or no? This is not a fact. There you go. I won't give you answer. Sorry. You cannot ask me that question. That's a very wrong answer. So, communication effectively. Basically, you just don't know the answer, but you don't know how to tell her. So, you tell your mom or dad. Build healthy relationships. Build healthy relationships. A young man from Rajasthan is working towards building very healthy relationships. You should really, I salute you because, no, no, listen, listen. Kahi logo ko chukde ho rahe hai wahan pe aur pura ghi dalai mein bhat maza. Aap jal rahe hai na, ghi dalai mein pura. Chara maate aur kya tha, piche ja ke kisi ko bata na. Aisa, bhot khara hai, aisa hi bolte hai. Sahi mein galat hua, tu ho jhala bhat hai. That is a typical habit many people have. Empathize with others. Empathize with others. What is the meaning of the word empathy? I'm sure you have done so many sessions. Meher Nosh Darukala was here and few other people were there. Empathy kya hota? You have heard the word sympathy. But how many have heard the word empathy? If you have heard this word, please tell me. Yeah, yeah. The person who has not spoken so far should speak. Yeah. What's your name? Hello ma'am, I am Akshata from BSC Bharatik First. So, Hi Akshata. I believe that empathy is uh, to understand someone's feelings and to realize what they feel. Very true. What is the difference between that and sympathy? Yeah. Sympathy is like uh, pitying somebody. Pitying somebody, very good. Pitying somebody is not a very good thing. But empathizing means putting yourself in their shoes and seeing how they feel. How they are feeling. You should actually feel them. How they feel, you should. Well, feeling means don't touch them. But you should actually feel their emotions. That is empathy. And that lady, that girl who went to that elderly gentleman in an ambulance was a very empathetic person. And all of you, sometimes yesterday I saw one. I had. A, I saw one. Um, one scene had happened in front of me, and for a moment I was so touched. There was a beggar on the middle of the street in Fatehganj. On the divider, he is lying down with his two children. And both the sides traffic is going on. So it's very scary to see. And small children, very small, one small kid, babies. And this man, he was not lying down, he was sitting. The children were lying down. Two scooters hit each other and some person fell down. But the two of them fell down. This person got up immediately and ran to save that person. Without saying that the children are lying there unattended. I, I was so scared. I said, what if the child comes to the road because some buses or some... Scooters may be hitting that child, but that man did not think like that. Of course, they are used to that life, that's another thing. But even then, for that moment, he did not think of his child and he went immediately. Think of all those cricketers, they are playing for the country. And who am I talking about? Father passed away, but they did not stop playing cricket. Yeah. Who am I talking about? Virat yeah. Kohli. Kohli and Hardik Pandya also. Yeah. The two Pandya brothers. Go to the man and manage their lives in a healthy and productive manner. Okay, this is the classical definition. Skill, life skills may be now, you have two types of life skills. Life skills for your personal actions and life skills for actions towards all others as well as towards the surroundings. There are two types of life skills. Life skills for yourself and for society. Now, discipline has to become a life skill. Discipline for self and different discipline for society. We will break it up further. We are going further into it now. Plus, ye sari cheezo ke basis mein self-discipline. Self-discipline lies at the bottom of all the life skills. These are the life skills that have been identified by World Health Organization. I don't know if you can see it. Can you see? You can't see? Okay, there are four. See, there are four quadrants. Positive mindset, higher order thinking skills, interpersonal skills, community mindset. See, ये बड़ी बड़ी बातें हैं ना, ये बड़े बड़े शब्द। ये ऐसा मत सोचो कि ये इससे हमारा क्या वास्ता? It is part of your life only. 
and you are all following all these things. But when we put it in theory, we put it into these big names and we put it as a theoretical framework. Let me explain to you. Take the case of problem solving. Just now you said about problem solving. That is a life skill. Communication is a life skill. Teamwork. How many of you are sports person? Are you sportsman? Anybody sportsman or woman? Which game? <coughs> Sorry? Rock Maltham. Rock Maltham. It's a, it's a single individual game. You? Cricket. So cricket is a team game. What is the importance of teamwork in cricket? How do you feel? 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 Teamwork. Have you seen the movie Chump Day? How many of you have seen the movie Chump Day? Please see it. Please see that movie. It teaches you about teamwork. The importance of teamwork. It's a very important story. Achha, you are going to be in studies. Where will teamwork be helpful for you? Where? Project? Then? In what are the things that teamwork is going to be helpful? Teamwork is going to be As a student, can you tell me where will teamwork help you? Anyone? Ask for the Hakama as a student. Good for the project work, okay. Anything else? Sorry? Any activities? Any activities you do? Whether you do some. Don't you do any uh, uh, sports event or annual day function, drama, music? Don't you do it together? Celebration ke liye to chahiye ke? Can you celebrate alone? No fun. You need a team for celebration. You need friends for celebration. See, yesterday I completed 15 days of placement in commerce faculty in MS University, wow. which is the largest faculty. I come from the largest faculty of MS University which has got 27,000 students. Just one faculty. And I see my placements. And who is this work? Not teachers mostly. Mostly students. Student volunteers. And their teamwork is so good. I have to salute them. That every day I tell them, when after the industry uh, experts have eaten, I tell them, please eat. Sab log khana khalo, sab log khana. They will not eat. They will wait for every, everyone to become free. Oh, sham to char, khanj bujay tak bedhe nahi. Kana nahi kani. And I told them that doesn't work, but they are not listening. Finally, yesterday they ate. After 15 days they ate yesterday, they listened to me. Every day they will eat in the end because they say, Aane do sabko, aane do sabko. Khana khane ke liye bhi koon group chahiye. Yes or no? Do you like to go and sit in the canteen alone? Never. Can you party alone? Can you watch a movie alone? Yes. 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 <laughs> then you will be a team leader. Okay, now that coming to the practical side of it, till now we were doing theory. Whatever theory we understood, it's possible that you will feel that she was giving a lecture and she went away, it's over. But my question is, if you have to make it a life skill, how can you convert discipline into a life skill? How do you make it a life skill? How do you start? So for that, let us take a few cases of people. Let's understand little, uh, discipline a little bit deeper. I'm skipping this part. There are three types of discipline, but I'll skip it because of time. Let's see a few cases. Which professions? Now I'm coming to some serious questions. Which professions do you associate with high degree of discipline? Anyone? Army. Army? Sure? Huh? Sure. Army. Good. Anyone else? Apart from armed forces, any other sex, any other nature of job needs discipline? Yeah? Civil services. Civil services needs discipline. Okay? Then? Medicine. In medicine, what is the discipline a person requires? For example, a doctor. What is the discipline in his life? For what he needs discipline, he or she? Sorry? Teaching. Okay. Yeah, let's finish this. Medicine thing. So for in medicine, what is the discipline you require, a person requires? Insan doctor hai, to wo discipline 
Good morning, ma'am. Good morning. Myself, uh, Priyanka Damaria from BSc Microbiology. So, our doctor requires equal persistence. Uh, they have to study each and every day of, of the upcoming uh, it is medical. Uh, upcoming uh, possibilities and all. And uh, along with that, they have to even provide duty at the hospital. Okay. So they have to provide. Uh, they have to give their duties at the hospital. They have to keep studying. She was talking about a student, medical student. I think you are looking at a medical student. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. She, from your age group, you are looking at a medical student. Fair enough. Very good. Medical students have books which are so fat. Have you seen their books? Really huge. Very tough. So doing all that exercise is quite a task. But I was looking at a practicing doctor who is very indisciplined. Assume. Patient has been kept nil from nil, nil by mouth means 12 hours fasting. 8 baje operation hai aur 8 baje raat se khana nahi diya hoon. patient. So baaki sari tayariya hogi patient OT pounch gaya hai, operation theater pounch gaya And our man is waking up at 7.45. Doesn't remember that he has an operation at 8 o'clock. Is it okay? Is that kind of life okay? Imagine a situation where a doctor forgets what is the treatment he is giving for this patient. Injection, wrong injection. Imagine that kind of disastrous discipline has to be highest. You are playing with life and death. Same way, when it comes to armed forces, you have said armed forces, I fully agree with you. We start with these cases of armed forces. Why did you say armed forces? What is the reason you said armed forces? Why did you say doctor? Is it because these are all science subjects, these are all technical subjects, technical subjects, huh? Technical subjects means that there are such things that are in the world one like the other. Technical, scientific subjects, all the subjects are like the other. For example, a person who has got jaundice will have yellow eyes, whether it is in Africa or in Malaysia or in Russia. That's why we call it science. It is equal and it is objective everywhere, more or less. So these are technical subjects for which you cannot, you have to be perfect. For example, a simple thing like this auditorium's uh, carpenter, he may not be an educated man. He may not have been an educated man. But the measurement with which he has made this curve is beautiful. It has to be perfect. The person who makes this, this edge and this edge, they have to join exactly at the same place. Yes or no? A car manufacturer has to be precise, like what they call Six Sigma perfection. Perfect. You have to be perfect. You have to be precise in your treatment for a patient. You trial and error with patients. That is why you have to say, go to the laboratory, take these following tests, come back with this. The test will not go wrong. Test has to be perfect. So this is why science subjects are always Now let me come to armed forces. I am asking a very broad question. Let me see if all of you are thinking minds. What is the reason why armed forces have highest discipline? Think out of the box and give me a good answer. Come on. Why does the armed forces demand perfect discipline? People from the DBA batch should also be contributing. They have to control their feelings. Yeah, they have to control their feelings. Can you give me a real life situation? Why do they have to control their feelings? Uh, suppose, uh, uh, for example, I am in the armed force and my brother is acting in terrorism group. So I have to kill my brother. So it needs too much. Okay, fine. Okay, Back to you want to pick, please. Ma'am, your one mistake can cause 
lives of thousand people. Your one mistake can cost the life of thousands of people. Brilliant. It can cost the life of your country. The whole country can go. Ain't bhul ke bade sir. Another thing. Any other answers? I want some more good answers. Real, real students, BBA students. Are you with us? Are you with us in this auditorium? Mentally and physically? Ma'am, uh, armed forces have to work in unity. They can't be like, tu kar, mai karta hu, tu kar, mai jana aise. They have to do what they are told without any questions being asked. So that's what, the, that is discipline. So I'm asking you why? That what you're saying is discipline. My question is why should they have so much discipline? Any idea? Anyone? Yes? The one in, uh, uh, boy in red t-shirt. The cat. What's your name? Smart. Bhugu Yadmin, ma'am. Hindi text CSC. What's your name? Bhugu Yadmin. B-H-R-U-G-U. B-H-R-U-G-U. G-U. G-U. Yes, ma'am. Bhugu Samhita. Yes, ma'am. The same is... Yes, yes, yes. The one you're referring to. Ma'am. Ma'am, that is so because of the responsibility they carry towards the safety of the citizens of the country. Okay. They have no other choice. That's a slightly broad answer. Can you be a little more specific? Good. I mean, your answer is very well taken. But can you be a little more crisp in your answer? Crisp, little crisp. Give me an example or give me, uh, illustrate with something which is more meaningful, which I can understand. Ma'am, careless, carelessness on their acts can be a compromise towards the yeah. safety of the country. So they have no other choice but to be disciplined. Fine, fair enough. All of you have answered very well. I would like one more answer and then I'll give you the, uh, some further input. <laughs> Anybody, one answer, one more answer we can say. And BBA please. Anyone from BBA? Next time you want, you want to answer this one? Or next time? This one, okay. Why suddenly two mics became one mic? I thought you were going to become hundred mics. And because they have to be aware of everything. Because when uh, they have to be aware when uh, any time with their war or any special operations will be begin. They have to be very careful and vigilant. They have to know what's happening around them. All that. That's why discipline. Okay, fine. Very good. Very good. Anyone else? Okay, now I will tell you something that will shake you up. Okay. I'll tell you something you, which you never thought. Okay. Which you never thought. Because I have given you all choice to answer. Nobody told me this answer. Okay. 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 Okay.
Do you know anybody? Have you, have you ever heard of this name Junjunu in Rajasthan? Why is it famous? आपको पता है हर फैमिली में से एक या दो लोग आर्मी में एंड ड्यूरिंग कारगिल वॉर एवरी फैमिली लॉस्ट वन पर्सन इन द वॉर सो इज इट नॉट अ ग्रेट थिंग एंड टू बी सर्विंग इन दैट प्लेस अनलेस यू आर डिसिप्लिन नो बडी विल गो सो दैट डिसिप्लिनिंग स्टार्ट फ्रॉम एनसीसी इन एनसीसी दे स्टार्ट गिविंग यू दे गिव यू सच ऑर्डर स्ट्रॉन्ग ऑर्डर दे मेक दम रन अराउंड उनके पैर के तलवे चिल चिल जाते हैं जब वो दौड़ते हैं इतना ज्यादा दिग्गजम सच इतनी कड़ी डिसिप्लिनिंग के बाद जाके बोलते हैं अब जाओ लड़ने एंड दैट इज हाउ दे आर फील्ड विद डिसिप्लिन दे फोर इवन द स्लाइटेस्ट मिस्टेक विल नॉट बी टॉलरेटेड ओवर देयर जीरो टॉलरेंस इन दैट सर्विस सो दैट्स व्हाट आई वांटेड टू टेल यू द हाईएस्ट एपिटोम और द हाईएस्ट एग्जांपल इज आर्म फोर्सेस फ्रॉम हियर वी स्टार्ट नाउ हाउ डू वी कंपेयर इट विद आवर लाइफ्स Let's take the not you and I are ordinary people. Let's see as celebrities. Do you think these people have had very simple lives? Do you think that these people are also having? What do you see of these people's life is the tip of the iceberg. Do you know the so you know what is tip of the iceberg? Have you heard this term? Tip of the iceberg. आपको बर्फ जो दिखता है वो सिर्फ थोड़ा सा है अंदर गहरा बहुत है. यहां तक आने के लिए इन्होंने कितनी परिश्रम की होगी कितना डिसिप्लिन किया और तब जाके आज यहां उन्हें करोड़ों करोड़ रुपया मिलता है बट वॉट यू डोंट नो इज वो चार बजे उठते हैं एंड दे लॉट ऑफ एक्सरसाइज दे है स्वीट्स दे हैल्दी फूड दे है अक्षय कुमार These people are known for their discipline. Akshay Kumar is considered to be the top most disciplined actor in the country. He does so much of exercise, yoga, meditation, and all of this. Now I want to tell you something very interesting. In the in सारे बड़े बड़े लोगों के कुछ qualities एक जैसे होते हैं. They have some common qualities, and those common common qualities are the steps towards becoming disciplined. And that's what I want to give you. We don't know. इस ऑडिटोरियम में ऐसे कितने लोग छिपे हुए हैं वी डोंट नो अमंगे Okay, where are the what are the areas of discipline? Let's go one by one. Let's start. Let's start with self-discipline. One area is self-discipline. Any quick answers as to what is it that you have to have in self-discipline? I want fast answers, rapid fire round. Come on, because we're running short of time. Yes, anyone? Quick, quick, four five areas in which you need you are you are you are worked on self-discipline. Now I want answer only from BBA. Clap for them, yeah. Come on. BBA. Come on. You can do it. Mike, को दे ही देना हम. They don't speak to us. सही अच्छा किया. Very smart, ना? You came to first row. You are going to occupy sofa. Uh, 
मुझे उठा के फेंकने वाले
जो काम असाइन किया है वो टाइम पे कर जो काम असाइन किया है घर पे जैसे दवा लाने के लिए बोला गया है छोटे छोटे काम ऐसे घर पे बोलते हैं मीनिंग ऑफ डिसिप्लिन इन योर इन योर इंस्टीट्यूशन I want some somebody who has not spoken to speak. Simple thing. Be very fast. I said rapid fire round. Somebody is googling it or what? What do you, what is discipline in institution? At least reaching the institution in time for your class. I came late. I agree today. But then your timetable and your schedules should be followed. Is one. Any other thing? Anything else in institution? Discipline in your institution? What is it? Sitting quietly. Sitting quietly. Or talking, sitting quietly until the man arrives. Yeah, it depends on where you are. Yes. It depends on the, if you are attending a lecture. But if you are sitting in the canteen and you are sitting quietly, that's bad. <laughs> I mean, you expected to talk in Calvary, you know, with friends. Not that when you are eating food you should talk, but okay, fine, good. That's also accepted. Anything else? What's your relationship with your teachers? How's your relationship with your teachers? With your teachers, with your professors, your principal, or whoever is your head of the institution. What should be your relationship like? Sense of yeah, respect will have to be earned by them. But from your side, I think demonstrating it is a very good quality, and it's a very nice thing. At least a sense of acceptance of the person is very very important, and I appreciate that point. Thank you. Now we move further. Discipline in social life. Discipline with friends, relatives, and public places. One one answer rapid fire. Rapid fire. Can I can I finish at 12:05 or 10? Because I don't want to uh, leave it in the brain. Yeah, because I started it. Yeah, come on, quick, quick. Rapid fire round. Discipline. I'm going to give you Hindi. I'm going to give you. Please don't be conscious of your English. Just answer. What is the discipline you should have in a public place? Come on, public place. Example. Standing for buying tickets for a theater for a movie. Have you experienced people pushing you and going the front? Yes. Why? What is the first thing you get? Angry? Yes. Yeah. What? Go back. Yes. That is indiscipline. Anything else? Anything else? You are having a party with friends in a hotel, in a restaurant. Generally, what happens? Noise? Shout? We are enjoying. We are enjoying. We don't care if others do like. Is that okay? Is that okay? It may be yes for you, but it's not a yes for others because they are also spending money and they have every right to have a peaceful time at a hotel, at a restaurant. The more expensive the restaurant, the more important this discipline is because उन्हें भी अधिकार है वहाँ खाने का और अपने पैसों का पूरा उनको पैसा वसूल करके जाना. So you have no right to spoil that. Am I right? What about your relatives and friends? What kind of discipline do you say? What do you mean by discipline here? When elders are seen, when elders are met somewhere, talking to them at least properly. Many times your mother and father will be complaining to you. Daddy, the mama came to speak to you. You went away. You didn't talk properly. Yes or no? Yes. Do you know what I'm talking about? You heard this. Now just think about it. There is a, there is a wedding. And or there is a let's say there is a death in the family somewhere, and you are wearing bright coloured clothes and those torn jeans and all that, and you are going there like a stud. Now is that okay? These are some of the things with friends. 
What is discipline with friends? What is discipline? You have taken something from them, return it back. You have given them some time for a meeting at some place, honor that time. Honor your work.